Hey, what's up everybody? So things are absolutely crazy. We're not on the road, you're at home, you're locked into your house, some of you are quarantined, all this sort of stuff, right? It's, it's insane, right? Untreaded waters that we're all going through together. One of the things is though, we miss being on the road because our favorite part about it is meeting you and hanging out with you and doing tricks for your illusions and all that sort of stuff. So I thought today we would do a little bit something different. I'm gonna do a routine, instead of doing it for you, I'm gonna do it with you. So here's what I want you to do. Pause the video right now and go get a deck of cards, any deck of cards, bicycle, aviator, doesn't matter, just go get a deck of cards right now, okay? Now what I want you to do is open that deck of cards up. You got it? Pause it if you don't have it, because we're gonna start in three, two, one. Perfect. Open the deck of cards up, look at them, now have a flat surface in front of you, maybe a table or the floor. Now what I want you to do is I want you to take any numbered card out of there. So you know, ace through 10, take any one, it's your choice, any numbered card, and lay it face up on the table. Perfect. Now, my turn. I want you to take, uh, let's do a four, take a four. It could be the four diamonds, the four hearts, four, so it doesn't matter. Put it face up on top of the card that you chose. Now, once you've done that, Find in your deck that you're holding any face cards, a queen, king, jack, any of those. Find any of those. Put it face up on the stack that you've been making. Now, take any card, it doesn't matter, there's no stipulations this time, any card of your choice and put it face up on top of that face card. Perfect. Now I want you to take any odd card. Now it's getting a lot. We're, we're making this unique stack of it. Take any odd numbered card, so one, three, five, seven, nine, Put it on top of the other stack. Face up, everything's face up. Now I want you to choose any card again. This could be anything you want. Put it face up on your stack, right? Now I want you to choose any even numbered card this time. Any even numbered card. Put it face up on that stack. Last but not least, I want you to take a three this time. So three of hearts, three of clubs, three of diamonds, or three of spades, and put it face up on top of everything else. You got it? Perfect. Put the deck to the side for a second. Now take that stack of cards that you just made. Put it face down in your hand. Now, we're gonna do some interesting stuff. Take the top card off the stack that you made, put it into the middle of your stack somewhere. Now, take any card from the middle and put it somewhere else in the middle of your stack. Got it? One last thing, take the bottom card of your stack and put it on top of your stack. Perfect. Now, sit your stack down for a second, go back to the deck of cards, and I want you to grab any nine, nine of diamonds, nine of clubs, whatever. Take that nine and put it face up on top of your face down stack that you've made. You got it? So you have one face up card on top of the rest face down. Now, I want you to deal out three piles like this, left, right, center, left, right, center, left, right, center, on top of each other. Do that right now. Perfect, sounds like you did that, I would assume. Now, take the three stacks and put them back together in any way. You can put the left on top of the right, on top of the middle. You can put the left on top of the middle, on top of the right, the middle on top of the right, it doesn't matter. Stack them back up. Now, I want you to cut the cards. So cut the cards. And now I want you to deal them out one more time. Left, right, center, left, right, center, left, right, center. Perfect. Now you should have seen the nine come face up. Whichever stack that nine is in of all these cards you chose freely, I want you to grab that stack. And you should have three cards there. Now here's the craziest part. This seemed chaotic. It seemed like there was no plan. There was no purpose. There was nothing going on behind the scenes. Here I am in Mobile, Alabama, and there you are wherever you are watching this video. And you think there's no way anything could come of this, right? But what if I told you I already knew what was gonna happen. What if I told you that you were holding a four and that you were holding a three? Now here's what's even crazier. I planned this because I wanted to tell you a message of hope today. If you look in the Bible, in the New Testament, the fourth book of the New Testament is the Gospel of John. Chapter three of that book has a really interesting verse. That verse is 16. If you add four and three, the two cards you ended up with, you get seven. If you add it to the nine, you get 16. John 3, 16. 
No matter where you are in the world watching this video, no matter what year it is, when you're doing this, if you're at home or if you're on the road, if you're on an airplane watching this video, here's the deal. This is a timeless truth that the God of this universe who made you loves you so much that he sent his son Jesus to this earth to die on a cross and rise from the dead for your sin so that no matter how crazy this world is, no matter how scary it is, no matter how just tumultuous your situation and the worldwide insanity gets, there is a God who is on his throne, the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords, Jesus Christ. And no matter how big our problems feel, he is in control. Just remember that while you're at home, while you're abroad, whatever you're doing, that God is in charge. I'm Brian Drake. Thank you for watching. Thank you for hanging out and doing this trick with me. You guys have been awesome, and we'll see you next time.